the inner me is just like. Y'all are about to get really introduced with this girl right here because she is her own person. Oh boy. Me and her been through it. Yeah. Me and my hair really have been, been through it. And this is my hair after I cut it in November. So, what, nine months? Of hair growth, okay, and I had um, I cut it into like a tapered pixie kind of cut, and it was like really short. Like, your girl ain't even had no hangs on. I got in the shower this morning, I washed my hair, I used a beer bag, I used the um, Garnier Fruities Full and Plush, they're paraben free. You know what? I ain't gonna try to read. I use shampoo and conditioner. Okay, I use Garden Hair Fruitises shampoo and conditioner. So I left the conditioner in my hair for a few hours. I got in the shower for around like eight, nine, it's probably like 11 already. So it's been sitting in my hair. All I did was just, you know, leave the conditioner in my hair and I've just been wearing my hair up like this. But it's time to wash this joint, get it blow dry. It's time to get her started. I don't know why I just put it up if I said that. So I'm gonna go on ahead, wash her out, and then come back to y'all. But before I do that, let me show y'all my curl pattern, how she's looking. My curls are bringing me back, and I'm hyped about them. Like, I'm so proud of how much of my hair has been growing and how it's been growing and how healthy it's been getting. That big chop might have been on y'all waist. Okay, y'all might have just did something. <laughs> but yeah, I'm gonna show you a few clips of my hair. Alright, so I washed my hair. I'm gonna I'll take quickly. some of this straightening cream. It's like a smoothing straightening cream that you before. It's like kind of like a heat protectant, okay? So I'm using about this much. And um my hair takes up moisture really good. Only part of that really I got a lot of issues with that I got beef with right now is the middle part of my hair, like right here. She just never wants to get her shit together and nobody likes to embarrassing me in front of company. Boom, break that out through my head. Now I'm gonna take some of my um, organic coconut oil. And when I mean a little, I mean like a little, and it's mainly for my problem area, which is the middle of my head. Like, <laughs> this much. Like a little, little, little bit. And just Alright, I'm so sorry that I keep changing the light, but now that I'm blowing drying my hair, I'm like, I gotta get into it. It doesn't have to be perfect. You're only blowing drying. Actually, let me take the smaller section. The rest of it.
not cut it. I trimmed it probably in like February, March, maybe. Um, or am I lying? May. I don't know, but I recently did trim it and um, I don't know. I'm getting eager to trim it again. So maybe I'll trim it maybe after I straighten it. Because, um, I don't know. I just feel like I like the healthy feel, you know? Like, I like how full it feels and stuff like that. I just, I just don't know. Just All right, so now that I'm done blow-drying my hair, I'm going to take my um, Conair Infinity Pro Flat Iron. And it comes in four settings, 365, 392, 419, 455. I'm gonna just put it on 392. I'm not trying to catch no heat damage. I just literally grew my curls back to how I like them. So, no heat damage.
taking this plastic wrap off, saying goodbye to it. Ooh. Oh, I did. Let me just tell you all. I did go on ahead and give my hair a trim just because I felt like she needed it. I'll show you guys the back. So yeah guys, this is the finished result. I'm loving it. <laughs> so yeah guys, thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. You should have hit that before you even started watching, but I ain't gonna say nothing. I'm gonna let you just slide on with the hit now. But yeah guys, thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. See ya in the next one.